guys, what's up? It's Tiana. I'm driving right now, vlogging and driving. I'm driving to Santa Monica right now because I have my first day of class. So I didn't do winter semester, so I had like a two month winter break and now I'm going back because it's the first week back for like spring semester. So I'm only taking two classes a semester because I only need to take two. Hold on, let me change lanes. Sorry the lighting sucks and I look ugly and uh... Why is the lighting so, what the? Don't worry, I'm literally going like 10 miles an hour, so it's okay. I have my first class today and I'm taking two classes a semester, so I'm taking a like survey of mass communications and a, a film class. So I'm going to the film class right now and the other class is online. Okay, this lighting's so bad. This first assignment was due last night and we have the whole week to do it and I started it at 9 p.m. So I think the semester is gonna be great. I don't even know what this class is. I don't know if it's history of film or like, some other type of film class, but this class is four hours. Four hours, it's from like 2.15 to like 6.30 or something. But yeah, so first day of class vibes. I'm not really prepared, I literally forgot that. I forget I'm in school all the time because I don't know, this literally doesn't feel like I'm in school. So my class is at 2.15 and it's uh, 11.37 right now, uh, but my friends all live in Santa Monica and I don't get to see them a lot because I don't live there anymore, so I'm gonna go visit them, maybe, go to Starbucks and like do productive stuff before my class, but I honestly doubt that's gonna happen. So no, Greg got in an accident. But no, it's not this side, this is Tom. Someone else did that and he did this, so now it's like evened out. Yeah, Loki, I mean like, not even that bad to be honest. Yeah, honestly it's fine. We got keys over here, we got keyed over here. Oh yeah, someone keyed him. That's you. <laughs> <laughs> right here. Oh my He's God. a line. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're cars, we're cars, the, the show. Going on a walk. Walking vibe, saving the environment vibes. <laughs> Hi. Mm. Ew, I look so nervous. Oopsie. We're uh, in Grant's room. It looks like there's nothing in here. Oh yeah, Grant's, le Grant's leaving today. Oh wait, there's a mirror. <laughs> Fit check. Grant's leaving today, he's literally going back to Florida. He just like told me yesterday, he's like, oh yeah, I'm going back to Florida, I don't know if I'm coming back. My friend's like dying on a cruise right now. <gasps> How do you feel? You're like, my life's really boring right my, now. My life's really boring. Oh, we're literally just sitting here. Don't steal my car. Don't steal your way? My car. His car? Oh yeah, we're gonna steal it. Love you. Hi. Wait, he is, he believes that he is, he believes. Yeah. Holy fuck. <laughs> We're just in Grant's room and he just like moved out. He said that he's not coming back. Bullshit, his car is He's coming back. back. Okay, his car's here so he has to come back. Okay. I'm with Jack. He's taking no, me no. to my car. Okay, wait, wait. So it is, um, it's 2.05 and my class starts at 2.15. I don't even know where it is. I've never even been to the building before. But he's taking me to my car. Bro, I don't even have a pencil. I don't have a notebook. I it's literally just scared. have my backpack with my laptop in it. I didn't have a notebook. Okay, so basically I went with Gwen to Carly's house. Oh, they don't even know who any of these people are. Went to I a friend's house. Went to a friend's house. Pretty much they're going to a Northridge party and uh, I was gonna go, but I have class and I'm responsible, so. Adult things, I guess. You sometimes have to sacrifice things. I'm probably gonna drop this class in the end, but. At least I'm going to the first day. I was almost not gonna go the first day. So they're going to the party and... Northridge Danger. Yeah, they're going to Northridge Danger and I'm going to my four hour film class. So I'll vlog, uh, I don't know, I'm probably gonna be rushing to get to my class, I don't know. And if you go in there and they don't have an affordable book that they can send, then you can go online and just be sure if you get a used copy that it's the 11th full edition, full textbook. Five, you missed half the lecture. And I'm not going to go back through it again for you. Missed on my, my lecture when you came late that day. I won't see those notes there. So I'll know you missed that. You can't camouflage anything with this course. To tighten up because so many students have abused, you know, especially in film classes. I don't know why it got out of control. And when I'm showing movies, guess what? I'm not looking at the movies. I've seen these a hundred times. I'm looking at all of you. And if there's a student, there's always one hiding, you know, they got a little cell phone on that's thinking, oh, I've got it hidden away. No, I see it. If a fly goes on your nose, I see it. 
Nothing gets past me. I go over that student and I say, get the hell out of here, go home. And uh, come back next week, don't ever do that again. And I'm marking you absent today. I don't tolerate that. We're in our break right now and I have like, I have like two hours left of the class. I wanna kill myself. So a review of the class so far, the professor sounds like such a boomer he really sounds like I, the whole time i was just thinking this man is definitely republican he seems really strict and the attendance policy is really strict and it's like you can only have one unexcused absence and like two tardies and then if you miss more you're gonna get like dropped from the class so yeah i don't know if i can handle a four-hour film class and he's strict about electronics like he's a boomer that hates phones so yeah i don't really know if I can handle this class. Maybe I should've just went to the party. <laughs> okay, I forgot I had these in my backpack. So this is my lunch slash dinner. I don't even have water. Them boy's hot, like, I'm gonna die. I really don't wanna go back into that classroom. But my friends texted me and said that the party wasn't lit, so I'm kinda glad that I didn't skip my first day of class for that. I don't have water. Also, I didn't even bring a pencil. I literally like, there was like a pile of pencils on Grant's floor. So I just grabbed one. And of course I grabbed a broken one. Oh wait, now it's working. Oh no, it's not. I look, I look dumb. I didn't bring paper either. I literally, and we can't use laptops or electronics. So I have that broken pencil and the syllabus. It's literally all I brought. Oh my god. Um, that was literally the longest four hours of my entire life. Whoa. Wow. That class went off. Felt so long. I'm so hungry. He went like two minutes over. I'm like, sir, this is a four hour class. Like every minute counts. And he was just taking his sweet time. But I have to drive home. There's probably going to be a lot of traffic. But yeah, I think I'm going to go get food or go to Whole Foods or just Maybe I'll just go home. I don't know. I'm super hungry though. Yeah, that was really horrible. Like that was just not a fun time. I'll vlog when I do something. So I'm trying to drive home because like I don't need to spend money at Whole Foods so I can just sit in traffic and starve. Sorry for this trash lighting too. Um, I don't want people to see me vlogging. Basically, it's gonna take me so long to drive home. I'm not sure if I should like go sit at a Starbucks or if I should like go get something to eat. I guess my best bet though is to sit in traffic because I do have to be home by 9 p.m. Wow, look at all that red. Super excited for this journey ahead of me. Can't wait to bring you guys along with me. I don't really know if I should keep vlogging. Basically, this is, this is, uh, current vibe. Zero miles per hour. The light's green, are we moving? Of course we're not. I just got home. Uh, that was literally such a long drive. Wait, I'm gonna put this. So yeah, my backpack, I literally just grabbed my backpack and left. <laughs> I didn't even think about like school supplies or like checking my email to see if they like email anything. I literally just went to class. Here's my syllabus. Here's what I did in class. <laughs> We're already off to a great start, learning a lot, really retaining the information. So review of the class. The professor sounds super strict. He seems like such a boomer, really like enforcing the rules. Me and him just aren't vibing. Basically he said no phones at all, which is a four hour class. He sits in the back and he watches us to like look, if, see if we're using our phones. It basically a recap of last semester. I literally skipped so many classes. I would leave class early and stuff. He was saying that like the, especially film classes at this college are like really, uh, like everyone would always skip or leave early. So two tardies equals an absence. And then if you're, ooh, cookies. Wow, we eating good tonight. So if you if you are late twice, that counts as an absence. But you only get one unexcused absence for the whole time. And then if you have another unexcused absence after, you get 100 points off. And then like, it's just 100 points every time you're absent, which I think is crazy. And now they make you sign in with your student ID number so no one can sign in for you. Like they have to know your number. And then you have to sign out like towards the end of the class there's another th like roll sheet. It's so annoying because my other friend took this class last semester and he said he literally never went because someone would just sign in for him and it was super easy. And he, made, he got to be in the class. And now I can't even do that. I have to go to all the classes. The reason why I feel like I'm going to fail this class is because literally this 
Attendance policy is so strict. I can't just have one unexcused absence for the whole semester for this four hour class Which by the way, my anxiety was going crazy in there last semester I had a three hour photography class and I would literally sleep or be on my phone the entire time And I still wouldn't stay for the full three hours like I would always leave in the halfway point like I just can't I just can't be in a classroom for that long. Like I honestly genuinely like couldn't be in there. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to last. And the textbook's super expensive. So I'm like, should I get the textbook even though like I don't see myself finishing the class? But like this class is required if I wanna like transfer and stuff. I think it's obvious that I'm not cut out for college. I'm not cut out for school and I should just stop and pursue something else that doesn't need a degree because I literally don't wanna do this. And our whole thing, like we don't have papers for the class. We just have a course notebook. So basically it's our notebook and it, it, we're like making a study guide for the class. So one part of it is like the lecture notes and the other part is like the textbook reading notes. And he's like, yeah, there's a lot of reading for this class. And he's like, yeah, the textbook's expensive. Like it's not cheap. I'm like, bruh, this is not like helping my case. Like I don't want to be in this class. I don't want to spend that much on a textbook. I'm not even going to read it. I know. I think it could be an interesting class, but like I can't be in a classroom. I just, classrooms freak me out. Uh. Should I just drop the class? No, I shouldn't because I have to take it. See, it's like I have to take the class, but I don't want to. It's a waste of money, it's a waste of time. I genuinely don't think I can do it. Like my, my attention span cannot be in a class for that long. When I don't want to do something, I just can't do it. So like, I my brain won't let me. Like why would I do it if I'm not happy doing it and then I'm not gonna do it, like, you know? Oh my God, but I have to, because school. See if I'm already thinking this much about if I'm gonna fail the class or not, I'm probably gonna fail it. So it's a waste of money and time. So my vote is to drop the class, but I think my parents will have a different view on it. So I have to drive an hour and then an hour and a half back home every Friday. I don't want to take this class. Oh my god, I want to drop out. I want to drop out. I literally want to drop out. I can't I can't be in that class. I don't see myself finishing that class. I'm gonna make dinner now. I'm on live. These are my viewers. I'm on live because it's Friday night and my curfew is 9 p.m. So I don't know what you heard, but um, don't listen to it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hello. I really want to drop that class. It was just not good. Like I'm still affected negatively by the class. So I put on a face mask. It's 10.38 on a Friday night. Have a good weekend. Let you back in my heart.